Good afternoon, everybody. Thanks for clicking on the Wednesday afternoon weather webcast for May 28th, 2014. I'm meteorologist Nate Harrington. This is how you can keep in touch with the afternoon weather webcast and me personally on social media. You've got our Facebook, Twitter, my personal Twitter, and my personal Google Plus accounts right there. That's how you can get in touch with us and make sure you stay up to date on all the latest weather here in the Wiregrass and post uh, other fun stuff on there from time to time as well. All right, let's get into uh, the weather right away. Uh, increased chances for showers and thunderstorms over the next few days. That is going to be the main weather story already active this afternoon. Now, mainly points off to our west and to our east are seeing the most abundant rainfall and thunderstorms now. Uh, some spots in southwest Georgia seeing some action. A few isolated showers have moved through uh, parts of our viewing area here in the last hour uh, to two hours. But for the most part, most of us have stayed dry. It's very warm and also humid. 92 Andalusia, 86 in Dothan, 87 Ozark, 87 uh, in Geneva, and 88 in Enterprise. Uh, 81 in Donaldsonville, they had a nearby shower that cooled them off just a bit. So not as much coverage in the thunderstorms as we thought just yet, but I still think we stand a pretty good chance to see some rainfall today. And over the next few days, it's plainly humid outside too with those warm conditions and dew points now getting into the middle and upper 60s and well, some low 70s. That's in the sticky to uncomfortable area right now. It looks like this humidity will continue to increase as the upper level low that is tracking to our west continues to track farther to the east. A lot of rain to our west. This is where the heaviest of the rainfall has been today. And as this system continues to track uh, more to the east, it's going to basically head this direction. Uh, you see the flow off the Gulf of Mexico. That will be a contributing factor to our increased rain chances over the next few days. Uh, I think not a great chance for severe weather, but basically the same chances we've seen here uh, since Memorial Day with uh, more heavy rainfall likely uh, for us as we head through uh, Thursday and Friday uh, as this, uh, the southern part of this uh, upper level low tracks closure. It's going to weaken. It's not going to be as strong as it is right now. However, still a better chance as this low tracks to the east. Here's your future cast for today. Underdoing our rain chances, I think, after 3 to 4 o'clock. Once again, good chances for thunderstorms and showers. A few showers around for tomorrow morning, but I think most folks will just start Thursday off on a foggy and very humid note, and then more chances for showers and thunderstorms as we go through Thursday late morning and early afternoon. We'll watch some form just off the coast and move into the wiregrass over Thursday and, and Friday as well. The future temperatures for tomorrow morning, yeah, right near 70, a little bit of fog developing too for your morning lows. We'll see right near 70 degrees, upper 60s too in some other spots. By 10 o'clock, model data coming in a little slow this afternoon right near 80 degrees by 10, and I think a decent chance to see some showers and maybe some thunderstorms by the time we get to noon on Thursday. It's going to be a very active uh, next few days. Looks like the weekend will be a little less active, but still going to have to keep our guard up for shower and thunderstorm chances for Saturday and Sunday as well. Maybe some drier air starts working here by Monday. Just have the umbrellas handy. Be uh, weather aware if any severe weather uh, breaks out. We'll break into our regularly scheduled programming on WTVY. Uh, channel 4 and also on WRGX uh, NBC for the Wiregrass and uh, also you can check out the five-day forecast WTVY News 4 at 5, 6, and 10, WRGX News at 530, and the CW Primetime News at 9. Everyone have a happy and safe rest of your Wednesday. We'll see you back here on Thursday.